The word Sigma or the lone wolf has been a trending topic and many people now mistakenly believe they are Sigmas just because they're introverted or misunderstood. While the life of a Sigma might be exciting for many, particularly those who have devoted their whole life catering to the expectations of society and seeking acceptance from others. In order to be a genuine Sigma, you need to have a lot more than simply the attitude or a few characteristics that are connected with this personality. A little amount of defiance is not always a bad thing, particularly if you want to escape the clutches of all the restrictions and expectations that are placed on you. Based on some studies, those with higher IQs have a greater propensity to be defiant. However, not in a manner that is annoying or negligent, but by the strength of the ideas that they have. Intelligent folks have a unique sense of style and they steer clear of following the herd. Because Sigmas are liberated from the constraints of society, many men now admire and want to follow in their footsteps and achieve the same level of independence. It's true that some individuals are born with the ability, but the vast majority of Sigmas living in the world presently were created. It is not impossible to become a Sigma man, despite the fact that the process may initially seem overwhelming. However, if you consider yourself to be a Sigma man but engage in any of the following behaviors, you are brainwashed and you should get that idea out of your mind. However, if you are serious about becoming a real Sigma man, here are nine things you must give up immediately. 1. Unable to discern when to be silent. Sigma men are experts at knowing when to talk and when to remain still. Silence is their most powerful weapon. Sigmas are usually reserved, and they give their words careful consideration before uttering them. To become a Sigma, you need to have the ability to know when to remain silent. You can't just start babbling the moment you have the opportunity. You may believe that you are a Sigma man because you keep your distance from other people. Nevertheless, this is just one aspect of the character. If you keep your distance from other people yet dominate the conversation whenever you are in their presence, you are not a Sigma man. You are simply making that up. The lone wolves never do that. You need to be able to recognize when to be quiet and listen, because if you are unable to do so, you will end up revealing information that you would have been better off keeping to yourself. Keep in mind that when you speak without control, your brain stops processing what comes out of your lips. As a result, you run the risk of saying something that may negatively impact you later. 2. Constantly seeking other people's approval. If you're the type of person who frequently seek approval before doing something, you're not a Sigma. Sigma guys are at the pinnacle of self-sustenance. They aren't continually seeking other people's praise and do not care about what others think of them. You must avoid relying on people's judgments if you want to be a real Sigma man. Besides, you don't need someone to advise you on what sort of automobile to purchase, which type of clothing to wear, where to reside, or your ideal date. Everything rests on you, therefore take action you want instead of trying to carry out what other individuals want since they won't have to deal with the results. Men in the Sigma fraternity are powerful and make judgments that they are at ease with. Being independent may sound rebellious, yet Sigmas don't require others to make decisions for them. You won't succeed in life if you always seek other people's favor before acting. Typically, the only ones who have the courage to travel the lonesome way arrive at their destination. 3. Disputes with people who have opposing viewpoints. Before you can even consider yourself a Sigma, if you're the type of person who doesn't want other people to have perspectives different from your own, you have to get rid of that habit. Despite the fact that they won't agree with them, Sigma guys like when others express their opinions. They enable others to express themselves, allowing them to learn from their errors and improve. Because you know one is flawless, you must allow people to express their thoughts. Don't merely argue incessantly to support your position. Even if you're correct, it's best to let someone express their opinions. 
Don't debate to prove you're right if you don't embrace them. Rather, gently lead the way, and if they balk, don't press the issue. A real Sigma guy will never impose his viewpoint on others. 4. Fear of the Dominant Males Because of their aggressive and threatening nature, Alpha men have historically dominated our society. This trait enables them to compel others to carry out their needs without being questioned. True Sigma guys, on the other hand, do not fear Alpha males since they are aware of their equal capability and ability to surpass an Alpha if necessary. Independent thought is essential to being a real Sigma. The more you think, the more you comprehend others. There is just no possibility that Sigma men could ever be terrified of him given how readily they can read Alphas. You need to get over your fear of the boss if you would like to become a true Sigma. Alpha guys may be snarky and domineering, but they are still just regular individuals. While they may be the heads of the park, you possess the same power to lead and rule. You must take charge of your own identity, own your choices, and accept accountability. Even if the Alpha attempts to use his power to compel you, don't be scared to say no. Only by being steadfast and standing your ground will you be able to free yourself from their sway. 5. Desire to Impress Others The major motivation for seeking ongoing praise from people is the desire to impress. You want people to think good of you, however the Sigmas do not act that way. They don't give a damn about what others think of them and won't try to sway anyone's mind. To live a phony life for others to believe you are flawless would lead you to the breaking point and drive you to seek approval from others. Sigma men don't falsify any aspect of their lives. They don't pursue attention or the need to win favor. Instead, they want recognition for who they really are. They desire that others value their skills, but they won't attempt to manipulate others to do so. Avoid trying to impress others if you want to get genuine appreciation. One must live beyond such trivialities in order to thrive as a lone wolf. Never strain yourself to the limit only to please those who might not genuinely care. Instead, try to become your unique self. 6. Your words and deeds don't line up. Great men are recognized by their deeds. Men of the Sigma fraternity are men of their word. They never promise what they cannot deliver. Due to their unwavering commitment to their words, many people often trust them. A Sigma will unquestionably follow through on his commitments. During acting, he does not say anything. Men who identify as Sigmas are very moral and responsible. They apply more actions than words. Therefore, if your actions are inconsistent with your statements, then you're not a Sigma. Keep your words if you want to be taken seriously as a real Sigma. Don't promise anything if you are unable to accomplish it. It is preferable to keep quiet than to make a commitment and then break it, or to make a commitment and then make a different one. 7. Rule Breaking for Fun The fact that Sigma guys do not worry about the societal norms in no way implies that they would violate the rules for the sake of breaking them. They are simply acting in this manner to serve a higher purpose. If there is a good reason, Sigma will disregard the rules and not look back, but they won't breach the rules for their own benefit or because they are being silly. There are a lot of regulations because there are a lot of individuals who are unable to think for themselves and because having rules is a means to keep everyone in control. Sigma guys are aware of this fact and will not voluntarily get their hands soiled for recreational purposes. These are the ones who understand better than anybody else that life is not a joke. You are just deceiving yourself if you go about violating the rules while proclaiming that you are a Sigma. If you are going to breach the rules, you should do it for a good cause. Do not engage in this behavior in order to play the role of the bad guy. Real Sigmas are aware of when it is okay to deviate from the norm and when it is not. 8. Putting on expensive clothes to look wealthy For alpha men, 
Dressing to impress is their norm, yet not for the Sigmas. A Sigma would prefer to wear dull clothes than an extremely pricey designer sweatshirt or anything else that seems too dazzling. You don't need to dress extravagantly, but your attire ought to seem uncomplicated and easy. The false impression is created when someone dresses to appear wealthy, and it also hides their need for acceptance. A Sigma male may still have style, despite this. Instead, they choose casual and comfy attire that showcases their unique personalities. They like to go around unobserved and don't want to draw too much attention. The Sigmas are not fashionistas either, they are natural and contented to stay that way. They won't purchase a shoe because it's in style, and they won't wear expensive clothing to flaunt it. The Sigmas are not the type who want to dress to fit in. So if you always dress to look wealthy, you aren't a true Sigma. Rather, dress naturally without calling unnecessary attention to oneself. 9. Considering yourself superior to everyone. A true Sigma man is aware that he is not more superior to others. A man's sense of superiority over others is a result of pride, although this is not the case for the Sigmas. The Sigmas are humble and modest. They don't consider themselves to be superiors and give equal respect and treatment to others. They aren't arrogant and would never exalt themselves over others. They want to see others as being on an equal footing. This enables them to freely interact with them. You're not a real Sigma if you believe that no one can match your level. You must behave like a Sigma if you want to be one. You have to see everyone to be equal and recognize that each person has a unique quality that distinguishes them from others.